And following a long tradition, voters in three tiny towns are actually voting right now. The first people in the state to cast their ballots at midnight Eastern time. Rescuers are still finding survivors in the aftermath of Friday's deadly quake that toppled a high-rise building in Taiwan. Let's check in now with Rich Fields uh, for a first look at our weather. Wow, incredibly warm out there today, Rich. But today marks the start of the Lunar New Year for many Asian cultures. Really festive. Well, the new push to improve California's earthquake early, uh, early earthquake detection system before it's too late. About half hour ago, the first votes were cast in the tiny town of Dixville Notch. Let's take a look at some of those early results. You know, it's not her singing that's under fire, it's her political stance. Maria Medina explains. So far, Beyonce hasn't issued any formal response about the controversy. Her most recent Instagram post today is simply a photo of herself laid out on a couch on a balcony, apparently resting. Well, it's time now to take a look ahead to the top of the hour. The debate of drafting women into the U.S. military is heating up in Washington. A New York senator says it's about time. Still to come, fulfilling a campaign promise by default. Back, I'm Lena Wynn. As Flint, Michigan struggles to cope with a crisis over the contaminated water supply, the lawsuits are piling up. Now, there have been several twists and turns to the story with an ending that still remains to be written. Here's a look at what's happened so far. And the controversy continues. Today, Supervisor Michael Antonovich said the eight-day period for residents to return isn't long enough. He's going to keep fighting for 30 days. But Devin Feely reports the system isn't getting all the support it needs to work properly, at least not yet. Well, many agencies aren't waiting anymore for the statewide system to get fully up and running. For instance, San Francisco's BART transit system just developed a system that lets trains stop up to 50 seconds before a quake. Well, Super Bowl 50 is one for the record books. Yesterday's game had an average of an infamous murder defendant is starting a brand new business. She spent much of her murder trial hounded by photographers, and now Casey Anthony apparently wants to become one. A well, what do you get a young panda cub who almost has it all? Oh, I love new trees. That's going to do it for us here on KCAL 9 News at 9. There's more ahead. KCAL 9 News at 10 starts right now.